It's time for the April edition of The Keto Box. And today on Two Crazy Ketos, we're going to open up this box and see everything that's inside. And we're going to eat it right, right after, after this. this. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Joe. And I'm Anthony. And this is Two Crazy Ketos. And here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos, we do product reviews, we talk about various keto topics, and then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. Now, you can find us on all kinds of social media like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. That's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week. So make sure you subscribe to our channel and make sure you hit that little bell button so that you are notified every single time we upload a new video. So we've got the April edition of the Keto Box. And uh, last month... Anthony joined me to open up this box and eat everything inside of it. Your boy is back. Your boy is back. So if you don't know what a keto box is, keto box is a monthly subscription box. It's got a bunch of keto snacks in it. Uh, there's a link down below as well as a discount code to get you some money off of your first box. If you do use that code, it does help the channel out a little bit and we greatly appreciate it. Uh, now if you don't know, Anthony is Rachel and Art, my middle son. So if you're new to our channel, Rachel is actually the other half of Two Crazy Ketos. This is Anthony. This is our middle son. Anthony is not keto. Mm -mm. He does like to eat some keto foods, like mostly the dinners, right? Yeah. Like what kind like of the meat, the meat, the, uh, the fatty stuff. Casserole and yeah, all the 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 entrees. He's not too much into keto snacks. He doesn't like the taste so much of almond flour, erythritol, things like that. Sweets. I don't, I'm not the biggest fan of sweets. Yeah. So last month, we thought it would be fun to have him try different things because if Anthony likes it, then we know that you guys are going to like it. So you ready to see what's in this box? Yeah. We're going to move the microphone because you talk quiet. So try right. to talk up a little bit. Okay. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. People ask us all the time, by the way, what is the difference between the Keto Box and the Keto Crate? Um, very much the same. Usually what one has, the other one gets the next month. Uh, it just comes down to preference. I prefer actually Keto Crate sometimes because Keto Crate seems to get a little bit more. They've upped their game, have a little bit more things that I've not tried before, stuff like that. Uh, also, Keto Crate gives you a website to get your coupon codes and tells you how much everything is. Keto Box just gives you a little card with coupon codes, but doesn't tell you how much it's going to cost, so you have to go and look for it, yeah. which I have already done. Uh, so I'm going to give you the different prices on things, but again, that's a quick search. A lot of times you can find it cheaper in stores, on Amazon, different things like that. So they do have a little coupon card with different codes. Uh-oh, there's a Slim Fast card in here. That usually means there's a Slim Fast product in there. Okay. So, are you ready? Yes. So we're going to go through each thing. I'm going to tell you the macros, how much it costs. Anthony's digging through the box. And then we're going to try each thing. What do we got? I put it the wrong way. Ketosis cups. I feel like I've had these before. These are almond espresso chocolate keto cups, two net carbs, two keto cups. You know what I need? What? I need my glasses. Oh. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Box. What are you doing? Are you sneaking? I was looking to see what was in the <laughs> box. Okay. I'm picking the order of the food. Oh, you're going to pick the order of the food. Okay, so the ingredients in this are cocoa butter, almond butter, erythritol, stevia, almonds, cocoa powder, coffee beans, and salt. Ooh, this sounds good. Mommy's going to want to yeah. eat this. Yeah. You ready? Yes. Yeah. So, two servings per box, 150 calories for each one, 15 grams of fat, two grams of protein, nine total carbohydrates, two grams of dietary fiber, Five grams of sugar alcohol, making it two net carbs per cup. Oh. That's kind of cool. Reese's. They look like a Reese's, but they're very thick. They're small, but thick. I'm just going to eat half of that. I'm going to save this other one for Rachel. Is it? Is there a wrapper on it? Looks it looks like there's a wrapper there on it. There is a that. wrapper. Okay. Just take a bite and give me the other half. Not bad. Hmm. That kind of reminds me of the keto brick. But very chocolatey. Yeah. A lot more chocolate. Mm-hmm. That's good. 
That is really good. That's actually pretty good. Um, and I kind of got the texture of a keto brick, like you said, but chocolate. It's a dark chocolate. Yeah. Thing. So again, this is how big they are. We're gonna save this one for Rachel because you can definitely get the coffee ground texture. That's what's making it feel like a keto yeah. brick. It's got the it's got coffee grounds in it. So the With price espresso. Yeah, espresso. So the price on those are three dollars and ninety nine cents per box. So two dollars per cup. Mm, not super not bad. bad, especially considering it's really clean ingredients. Yeah. Next up, ice chips, candy, lemon flavor. I don't know what to expect of these. So you're gonna read the ingredients? Sure. Ex Xylitol? Xylitol. Xylitol, certified organic natural flavors. Natural flavors. Lemon oil, citric acid, cream of tartar, calcium stearate. Okay, so it's pretty clean ingredients. Yeah. And serving size is two pieces. Um, five calories, zero grams of fat, two grams of carbs, zero grams of sugar, two grams of sugar alcohol. So zero net zero carbs. Car yeah. Okay, so one thing about these, these are sweetened with xylitol. Xylitol is deadly to dogs. So it really? Yes. It will, just the oh. smallest amount can kill your dog. Um, even like one of these, it goes by weight, but I can tell you like one piece of this would kill Tabitha. So imagine what it would do to a little tiny dog. Oh my gosh. So be very careful if you do have xylitol in your house, like put it high up. Even a lot of toothpaste do have it. I'm interested to try this. I can't open it. You're using my Grandpa Joe letter, letter opener. I can open you're, it. You're not going to let me open it? No, I want to do just it. Just pull it I got apart. it. It wasn't oh, you working. It. Okay. Just give me one. So these like little candy chips? What well, is that? Like, Are they all different sizes? Or are they yeah, all I mean, it's kind of just like sugar, poured sugar, Ooh, and then they cracked it. That smells like lemonade. It does. It smells like candy, sugared lemonade. So that's what it looks like. Dang, it's good. That's good. Oh, those are addictive. I'm going to take these for myself. You got to give mom a couple of them. Just give her a taste. Damn. She's not getting to eat the box. You got to give her a taste. This stuff is good. Okay. Price on those are, you can buy it in, they come in tins, like Altoid tins. Um, but I think they're bigger. That makes sense. And so they're $5 a tin. It comes in like 3, 6, 12, 18, 24. The more tins, the cheaper it is. The cheapest option is three tins and it's $5 a tin. But then the more you get up, the, yeah. get, the cheaper it gets. It gets down to like, I think, $4 a tin. Yeah. Next up. You didn't explain the price, did you? I just did the oh, price. I $5. Thought I, I thought you said for one of the tins. Yeah, well, yeah, but you buy it in a, in a oh, set of okay. three, six. And again, you might find it cheaper somewhere else. That's directly on their website. Chalk Zero, Zero Syrup. It's caramel syrup. This is caramel. Oh, this, so this is like put it on your ice cream. Yeah, put it on your Keto ice cream. Chow. Ooh, this might be part of dinner tonight. That is the tiniest writing ever, but I think I can read it. I can read it. I can read it. Okay, you do that. I'm not that old. Okay, ingredients in this are liquid vegetable fiber. Okay. Natural caramel flavors, monk fruit extract, caramel coloring. I wish it didn't have caramel coloring in it, but... Um, serving size is one tablespoon, 32 calories per serving, 15 total carbohydrates, 14 grams of dietary fiber, and then uh, that's it. It doesn't have sugar alcohols because monk fruit's not a sugar alcohol, it's a natural sweetener. So it's one net carb per serving. We need a spoon. These ice chips are really good though. I'm going to take these. We've got a spoon. Yes. You ready? I was going to eat an ice chip and then you came back. Nice. That's good. Now, this is a liquid vegetable fiber. Um, I'd have to test my blood sugar with it to know like what kind of impact it has. It smells like caramel. If anybody knows of any, like, anybody who's done a blood sugar test on this, let me know down below. Hold up. Oh, my God. That's really good. That is really good. I love Chalk Zero products like the candies. We do have a code form. I'm going to leave that down below. Uh, we are affiliated with them. But I've never... That is good. That's good. That will be going on some Keto Chow ice cream tonight. <laughs> that is really good. Price on that, $7.99. And again, I'm, I think we have a code. If we do, uh, it'll be down below. But I know we have a link for it. Next up. Slim Fast Keto. Slim Fast. So... Uh, I, I, I see it as your voice. You're not the biggest fan of this. Okay, well, actually, I know we've seen these before. Um, 
If I remember right, I'll let you read them. The ingredients aren't super bad, but they're not super great. Oh my gosh. I just don't like supporting like some of these bigger companies that are just jumping on the keto train. Yeah, this is a lot of stuff. Okay, let's hear them. Okay. Chocolate coatings, unsweetened chocolate, cocoa butter, insulin erythritol, calcium inulin. carbonate, inulin. Inulin. Um, inulin. Milk fat, stevia leaf extract, natural flavor, vanilla extract, MCT oil blend, coconut and palm kernel. Sodium calcinate, erythritol, inulin, cocoa powder, natural flavors, salt, sunflower, and or soy lecithin, stevia leaf extract, natural color, and paprika. Yeah, it actually doesn't have super bad ingredients. No. Because they're – well, they're listing everything that's in the chocolate, oh, everything okay. that's in the they peanut it. butter or whatever. So it's got – wait, where's the nutrition go? Oh, it's over here. So one cup – 90 calories, 8 grams of fat. It's got 7 total carbs, 3 grams of fiber, 3 grams of of sugars. And it's a retrotol, so it's an alcohol, and it makes it one net carb. One net carb. Okay, ready? Yes, I shall. Now, and again, we had them. What flavor was this, by the way? Car- caramel cup. Caramel cup. You were supposed to show them, like, the size of it. It's kind of small, isn't it? It's the size of a Reese's. I don't know. That looks smaller no. than a Reese's. Hmm. That's not bad. That's definitely better. This is better. Yeah, that's definitely better. That's very soft. It's almost like eating caramel. It's not bad, but... It's very much a Reese. It's, well, caramel, though. Yeah. But it's... I don't know. There's something about, like, it's very melty. And to feel like it would be a trigger for me, it's a little too sweet for me. It's very sweet. Obviously, it's not sweet for you. It's good to me. But do you find it very sweet, yeah, especially I mean, for a keto yeah. food? For a keto, I don't know, it may trigger me. I prefer this thing here, which had some texture to it, or the Lily's cups, or even the oh, keto yeah. cups. Now, Rachel and I just recently did a review of those Lily cups. I know you even gave her some for Easter. And so I'll put a link for that video over Anthony's head. Oh, price on those. Oh, we didn't do that. Okay. On Amazon, the price of them is $8 for a box of 14 but I do know some stores sometimes put them on sale and stuff. That's not bad. All right. Next up. I'm going to get all the desserts out of the way. Then there's nothing Dark. good to try afterwards. No, but these all look good. Oh, okay. Oh, you're getting – well, you said out of the way. Like no, no, you want to no. eat all the desserts first. No, I'm saving some of them. Okay. Eat, save something for sweet for last. Keto bar. Keto bars. Dark chocolate coconut I almond. I love keto bars. Uh, this is the original keto bar. They're the first company to come out. When I first started keto, this was the only company that had a keto product on oh, the wow. market. Like a keto kind of bar treat. They used to send them to you in like fast food, like Chinese takeout boxes. Huh. It was really cool. Uh, they were all p- wrapped in plastic. They've come a long way. Uh, we do have a link down below, hmm. uh, but really good ingredients, but I'll read them anyway. Ingredients in this are chocolate, almonds, coconut, Cocoa processed with alkali, non-GMO, erythritol, water, coconut oil, salt, and stevia. That's it. Clean ingredients. Serving is the entire bar, 230 calories, 20 grams of fat, 6 grams of protein, 15 total carbohydrates, 7 grams of dietary fiber, 5 grams of erythritol, and that's going to make these, I think, 3 net carbs per bar. And all of those fibers are just coming from the chocolate and the almonds and the cocoa. So it's not like they're adding in a bunch of fiber or stuff yeah. like that. This is the dark chocolate coconut almond. Have you ever had these? Have you tried them? No, but I'm the biggest fan of coconut. I know. Unless, is there coconut flakes in it? No, it's not like the texture. Okay, like well, like little, like there's little, there is little pieces in it, but it's not like flakes. It's like chopped up kind of like a mound. Flavor, not texture, because I know you don't like the texture of coconut. Kind of tastes bland. Kind of just tastes like I put chocolate in my mouth. I love this. It's very crumbly. It's just top up. Oh. It's very rich. Yeah, it is. Very fudgy. So. Don't like the texture. You don't like the texture because of the Coconut. coconut. They do have a mint one that almost t- makes it taste like a Girl Scout Thin Mints. I have a couple of boxes of this if you want to try them. This is my second favorite flavor. Oh, and they have a strawberry one. That's made with that's strawberry. Probably, that sounds better. Chocolate covered strawberry. Price on those. Yeah. Again, we have a link. I'll put it down below. $2.50 per bar. Oh, okay. 
Let's see. I know because I buy those a lot. Yeah, I'm gonna say. Let's do these. So, Quavos. Quavos, made from egg whites. So, this was also in the Keto Crate box this month, but a different flavor. So, we were actually saving them for you. Oh, look at that. Okay, so the ingredients. Egg right, oh wow, not right. Egg whites, <laughs> ghee, milk, milk protein isolate, inulin, chicory root fiber, coconut oil, seasoning blend, modified tapioca starch, garlic powder, onion powder, salt, spices, paprika, yeast extract, natural flavor, sugar, wow. That's just in the seasoning, yeah. yeah. Sugar, aged red cayenne peppers, distilled vinegar, tomato powder, green bell pepper powder, natural extractives of paprika, lime juice, Lacidic acid, citrate acid, avocado oil, chia seeds, contains less than 2% of the following. Psyllium husk? Excuse me. Psyllium husk. Psyllium husk, sunflower, re- let- wow. lecithin. lecithin, and flax seeds, contains egg, milk, and coconut. Anthony's getting a quick, like, tutorial on ingredients. Yeah. Um, the serving size is one bag, which is about 35 chips. It is 140 calories, 10 grams of fat, 5 grams of saturated fat. 160 grams of sodium, 8 grams of total carbohydrates, 4 grams of fiber, 1 gram of total sugar, and 8 grams of protein. So that makes it... What? Four net carbs. Four net carbs for the whole bag. Not now, cat. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is the Cuevos Ranchos flavor. I like the fact that they make them in avocado oil. Are you ready? Yeah. Oh, so by the way, so as you're reading ingredients, when you see it like in parentheses, that I know means it's what's in that. I that's know. like what is that is yeah, the seasoning. The seasoning is made with. Ooh, that smells pretty good. Oh, it does. It smells like. Oh wow, they've changed these a little bit. It looks like a little cheese trip crisp. Oh, those are good. Those are good. Those are really good. That's the best flavor I've had. There's another whole bag of sour cream and onion ones if you want them. Oh, you gotta eat those. Those, those are, are really, really good. We'll try, let mom try those, and then you can have the rest. Those are good. Those are really good. So price on the Quavos uh, off of Amazon, you buy them in like a bag of a box of six or whatever, $2.50 a bag. Not bad. But they're egg whites, basically, is yeah. what they are. You need to figure out how to make these. I would. What's up? All right. Next. Smart cakes. Love smart cakes. So this is the vanilla latte flavor. Uh, we do have a coupon code for them. It, I believe it's two crazy ketos. I think I get you ten percent off. I'll leave it down below. So if you like to want just like having like a little hostess kind of cupcake treat once in a while, but want it guilt-free, this is the way to go. The ingredients in these are eggs, purified water, proprietary fiber blend, which is oat fiber, corn fiber, and flax, erythritol, whey protein isolate, olive oil, pure vanilla, cinnamon, ground coffee, salt, cellulose gum, monk fruit, citric acid, spices, and herbs. So there are two servings in this package. So a serving size is one cake, which is 38 calories or 76 for the whole package. 2.5 grams of fat, 9 grams of carbohydrates, 5 grams of dietary fiber, 4 grams of erythritol, which makes it zero net carbs. It's got 4 grams of protein. Now these are actually why I always say that even if you're counting net carbs, put a total carb cap on yourself because this is how I can get myself into trouble. So if I eat 10 packs of these, which I could easily do, or even five packs of these, I would be eating 90 total carbohydrates but zero net carbs (laughs) and only eating 380 calories, which is like equal to one of those uh, uh, hostess cakes. Yeah. So this is what they look like. They come in these little wrapper things. This is the vanilla latte flavor. My favorite was the orange cream. Mom's favorite is the cinnamon one. Dang, that's good. These are good, aren't they? They're good. These are really good. This is a good box this month. So far. You like have almost everything in here. Is there anything that you didn't like other than the keto bar? You didn't like the keto bar. Don't jinx it. Don't jinx it? 
What's up next? Wait, we didn't oh, review price. the price. Uh, price on them, they are a little bit expensive. They're $3.50. You buy it in a box of four or a box of eight. Once you make a purchase, you actually go into their discount club, so you get discounts on them. They have sales all the time. And again, we do have a coupon code. It's two crazy ketos. Next up. All right. I'm going to do this. California Keto. California Keto. Okay. So it's a Is this one of the, we have to make that? Yes. I guess we're going to have to go cook it. So it's kind of like those uh, birch bender cups. Yes. Okay. So ingredients, almond flour, erythritol, monk fruit extract, chocolate chips made with unsweetened chocolate erythritol, cocoa butter, stevia extract, sunflower lecithin, grass-fed butter, wow, grass-fed butter powder, vanilla powder, golden flaxseed meal, baking powder, SEA salt, and sea salt. Oh, S-E-A. wow. <laughs> I totally just blanked out. I just want to eat it. Okay. SEA salt. Okay. And contains milk and almonds. It is, serving size is one cup. There's only one we only obviously. need the fat, the protein, and the carbs. Okay. Well, it's got 240 calories. It's got 21 grams of fat, uh, 18 grams of car- carbs, 4 grams of fiber, and 2 grams of sugars, and 11 grams of sugar alcohol. Wow, that's a big, that's a big hop. So, okay, so wait, all in all, how many? What's the total net carbs on it? Three. So 18 grams of carbs minus 14 grams of fiber minus 11 grams of sugar. Okay, what alcohol. do we have to do? So we need to add a tablespoon of water, stir until combined. Microwave for 45 to 60 seconds and then cool slightly. Okay, so we're going to go make this. We'll come right back. Now, Anthony, you can't do your heavy cream hack. I okay? won't do that. Got to try it the way it's designed. Okay. Future Let's... ones, you can do heavy cream. Okay, I can. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, we're back. How does it come out? Looks like this. <laughs> oh, it smells good. What, is there a flavor to this? Oh, it's just chocolate chip. Chocolate chip cookie. So it's like a cookie cup. That's what it's called. Okay. I feel like we could do better. The Birch Benders one is better. It's okay. It's okay. It's it's like it's the, okay. The Birch Benders one is definitely better. The Birch Benders one is better. Yeah, it's it's okay. It's not horrible, but I don't know. Let's see. What's the price on them? Price on those is three dollars and twenty nine cents per cup. How much were the birch benders? I don't remember. Like Two fifty. Two fifty. Okay. It's a little much. What's up next? Um, I, need a, I need a drink. I forgot that we used the same spoon from that uh, chalk zero. That stuff is sticky, like it syrup is. sticky. Like that's a good thing. So beef, so DNX, beef, jalapeno, and hickory smoked bacon meat stick. Ingredients, beef, smoked bacon, made with pork, water, sea salt, vinegar, cultured celery powder, and in the culture, in the cultured celery powder, there is celery powder and sea salt, there's medjool, medjool dates, sea salt, spices, garlic powder, coconut aminos, encapsulated citric acid, jalapeno powder, jalapeno chili flakes, minced onion, cultured celery, juice powder, Celery powder, sea salt, and beef collagen casing contains coconut. Wow. I, the is, one thing I love about DNX, there's no sugar in their stuff. Yeah. I really like the ingredients that they put in their stuff. So I don't see anything. It doesn't say there's any carbs. That is the one thing about most meat sticks. They don't put it on there. If I remember right, that one doesn't have any carbs, but there is a link down below for them. <laughs> You're going to take that whole thing out. I'll eat it. I don't care. Okay. Here. Just give me a little piece. Thank you. Thanks for the little piece. You can what you want. That's good, though. That is good. That's good. Mmm. Smoke flavor really comes through on it. Jalapeno is not too kicky. It's not too much of a kick. Just a little bit. Just Usually, I get their meat bars. I don't. Have, I've never had their meat sticks before. Uh, comes obviously like in a box of 12. It works out to be for them $1.75 per meat stick, meat stick, right in line with most other, you know, like meat stick products. Next up. Uh, all right, do we no, want I'll save that for last. The brownie? Yes, absolutely. Yeah. I've never had that. Okay. So next uh, up, you can read this one. You read two in a row. Okay, so these are intact black pepper crunchy sneeze, uh, cheese snacks. Rachel and I actually- Sneeze snacks? Cheese snacks. I, cheese snacks? I know, but then I corrected myself. I said cheese. Okay. We actually met the owner and creator of these last year at KetoCon. 
really cool story. Uh, so the ingredients in this are Chilean buttery cheese, which is pasteurized semi-skimmed cow's milk, salt, and uh, egg, microbial enzymes, cheese cultures. Then you have black pepper salt. That's it. Servings is two servings per bag, 18 to 20 pieces in a serving size, 80 total calories, 6 grams of fat, 5 grams of protein, less than one total carbohydrate. So one carb, right? Yeah. These are good. Usually I find they need salt. I, but if for me, everything needs more salt now. What is this, black pepper? Basically, yeah, they're basically dehydrated cheeses. Hmm. Just need salt. I don't really taste any black pepper either. Yeah, that one's kind of bland flavor. It kind of just tastes like cheese. That one's a little bland compared to some of the other flavors they have. Yeah. That they're not bad, though. They're not bad, but they've got other flavors which I've liked better. $2.50 a bag. Right in line with most other cheese products. All right. Last one. I saw this, and I was excited. All so, right. high key, these are... Brownie Bites. Brownie Bites. I have not tried these. All right. We do have a coupon code for high key. I will leave it down below. It's two crazy ketos. I think it gets you 10% off. So the ingredients, almond flour, erythritol, monk fruit extract, stevia extract, butter, cream, milk, salt, cocoa powder, whey protein concentrate, trait, almond butter, coconut oil, vanilla extract, phyllium, psyllium. Psyllium, baking soda, non-GMO dried egg whites, sunflower lecithin. And it has a hundred, so two servings per container, container, it's about six pieces, 140 calories, 12 grams of fat, 15 grams of cholesterol, 11 grams of total carbs, 3 grams of dietary fiber, 1 gram of sugar, 6 grams of erythritol, and 5 grams of protein. So, so what is that? It makes Nine, it two net carbs? Two net carbs. So four net carbs if you have the entire bag. So Anthony, just earlier today... No, it's... Yeah, two net carbs per for the whole... Per serving. Yeah, but so it's four so net it's carbs four for the, for the whole, whole bag. bag. Yes, I'm minutes. sorry. So... Was it today or last night that I gave you for the first time ever the chocolate chip cookies from High Key? Was it was it yesterday? Yeah, that was the first time he's ever had them. So this is the same company. Oh, okay. I'm really excited to try these. They just came out with a Rice Krispies cereal that I want to try. So this is what they look like. Not for me. Really? Not for me. Oh. More for me. Mm-mm. Not You're a not fan. a big, huge chocolate fan. No. Like, solid chocolate. I still like the chocolate chip ones better. The ones you had last night. But if you like solid chocolate, double chocolate... Tastes like a little these bite. These are good. Okay, they taste like a little bite, yeah. When I was a kid, we used to get the boxes of, you had animal crackers and there was a chocolate one that came in a little box with a handle. Mm. And I used to always like the chocolate one. They had like little grains of sugar on the top. These, what, that's what these remind me of. These, I think they're good. Obviously, Anthony, not for him. Now this. But I like them. Well, that is our video for today. Again, I will leave links for all the different products that I know of down below for our favorite products. Uh, let us know down in the comment section, which of these products would interest you. I think Anthony is taking most of this stuff to his room. Yeah. <laughs> Please do us a favor, hit that like button down below, and also make sure you subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell button so that you are notified every single time we upload a new video. And until next time, bye. bye.